Reporting for Newsreel, I'm Dr. Anthony Harper here at the White House. A new issue here at the White House is that I met a USA Today reporter, Joey Garrison. He brought up a question about free testing. Earlier I heard from Medicare that testing should be free since vaccines are free. And of course I have an official White House letter regarding that testing issue. So in my response to the, the White House is the issue of the testing should be free because Medicare said as a Medicare recipient I'm supposed to be receiving free testing. So it was very encouraging that this USA Today reporter brought up this issue about free testing for people, including the issue about sending free tests to people at home, these free home tests. So um, this is a update, a, a new turn of events with the, the testing issue getting more attention here in the White House by other reporters. Along with that issue that the USA Today reporter Joy Garrison uh, brought up about free testing, Press Secretary Jennifer Psaki said that free tests would be available to people at many pharmacies and doctor's offices, but yet have not seen that free testing here at the White House. When I'm here today asking a question about from the CVS Pharmacy, which has an exclusive contract with the White House, the CVS Pharmacy people here said that they do not accept insurance. Medicare has mentioned that this test is supposed to be free for me as a Medicare recipient. There's also the issue about how unvaccinated journalists are being treated here at the White House. To my knowledge, I am the, the last holdout here uh, or the only unvaccinated journalist. And the way the other journalists and media people treat me is, is very alarming. I'm often being harassed and ridiculed for not being vaccinated and treated as a leper here because of that issue. A final comment regarding testing and its impact on freedom of the press. For any restriction for access to the White House regarding this testing issue becomes an assault on the freedom of the press.